what's up you guys welcome back to the channel it's your girl t and today i'm going to see if i can make some money of course i don't want to do this but uh, you know in life you just got to do things you don't want to do so that you can start doing the things that you want to do and today i really want to make some money at least 200 dollars um, as you guys know, I have not been doing gig work for like six months and um, I miss the extra income. I miss you guys, and um, but I really miss the extra money, okay? So I'm out here. I just started up the car to warm it up because in Michigan, it's like 20 something, 30 something degrees. I don't really know, but the first thing on my list is to get some gas because I am all the way on E. Yeah. So let me do that before I run out and I won't be able to even make it to the gas station. So I will meet you there at the gas station. All right, you guys. So I made it to the gas station. I didn't run out. As you can see, it's pumping right there. Um, I'm using the Get Upside app to earn cash back for pumping gas. This video is not sponsored. I know it always sounds like it, but if you have not heard of Get Upside, check it out. There's a link in my description box. If you click on that link and sign up, you get an extra 15 cents off per gallon, and so do I. But it's really easy to use. You go to the gas station. Um, <clears throat> I have a whole video out on it. I'll probably just link it up somewhere on how to download the app and use it and all of that good stuff. So I'm about to pump this gas. I'm gonna be here for a minute because I am completely on E and it'll probably take about 40 to $45 to fill up. I don't know. So I will see you guys when I get in order to deliver. So see you guys later. And here we are $46 and 40 cents later. Time to go make this money back. All right, you guys, so I've been sitting in the car declining orders and I'll put some examples up on the screen and tell you why. And it's mainly because the offers are extremely low and the distances are further than what I like to drive. So my dash has just been paused automatically by DoorDash for 10 minutes because it appears that I'm not taking orders and they want to give other dashers an opportunity. Um an opportunity to accept orders i suppose um so i've seen that floating around for a minute on the internet that if you don't accept orders and you're declining so many that they will pause your dash so i'm chilling right now now there were i'm gonna say two orders i could have considered taking <clears throat> excuse me because they were not horrible horrible but i feel like it's not good enough to get my day started um i turned on grubhub i turned on uber eats i haven't received an offer yet it's been about 15 minutes nothing has come through but the two orders that i probably should have taken both were at chick-fil-a one was paying i want to say six dollars or six dollars and fifty cents and it was going like 3.4 miles and then the other one at chick-fil-a was like five dollars and 75 cents and it was going like four miles <sighs> not awful but it's not what i'm looking for so if i actually get an order i will be back but i feel like i'm just going to have to bite my tongue and really just do whatever right now um because i want some extra money i want some side money so i'm gonna have to do something there's nothing on instacart there's nothing on shipped gotta do something so i will come back and let you guys know what happens but that's the update for now so see you in a minute all right, you guys, I finally got an order, an order that I like. It's paying like $14.40, I think, and it's going like 2.1 miles. These are the orders that I live for. So I just picked it up, put it in the back seat, and I'm about to go drop it off now. 
All right, you guys, I am working on order number two via Grubhub because DoorDash is not treating me right today, but it's another order at Panera Bread paying $13 or like $13 and a penny going on the um, offer card. It's going to say like 4.3 miles, but it's only about 2.8 miles. I'm taking like a different route um, and, and I'll end up at the same destination, of course, but 13 something, 2.8 miles. These are the orders that I like. So I'll show you what the order is. It's another big bag from Panera, as well as a half a gallon of green tea. All right, you guys, so I got the order, had to wait a couple minutes for it, but it's a pretty huge order. So time to pack it up in my car and drop it off. So, so far we're at what, $27? It's been about a little over an hour if you wanna count me sitting around declining orders. It's been a little bit over an hour. So that's where we are. I don't know how much I'll make today um, because it's not really looking promising for me, but I'll keep you guys posted. All right, you guys, I'm about to do order number three. It's at a Coney Island, and it's paying $10.53 to go about 3.4 miles. Now, it might actually be a shorter distance because with my GPS, it always looks for the fastest route, not necessarily the shortest route. Um, that's what happened with that last order. But Grubhub has been good to me today, but DoorDash has not. Um, so we will give it another try with DoorDash, maybe within like another hour. But right now I'm rocking with Grubhub. Um, so far I've declined about 50 plus DoorDash orders. If you would like for me to post all of the screenshots, I will be more than happy to do so. But let me go inside and get this order. I will see you guys in a minute. All right, you guys. So the last order I just did, which was order number three for the day, um, it put me really close to the laundromat, which is where I needed to come anyway. So I'm taking a little break to wash my clothes and do all of that. And um, that's pretty much it for this moment. So right now I'm ending at $37.94, um, which I guess is not bad for two hours worth of declining orders and delivery. I started, I looked at my first screenshot for the day and it was like 11.10 this morning. Right now it's 1.20 p.m. So two hours, um, three orders, most of it was sitting around declining. So that's still not bad, 18.97 per hour. It's not bad, but way back when, I could have been at probably $50 right now. So it wasn't terrible. I'm actually surprised I even made this much. I'm very surprised. Um, but it gives me a little bit of hope that... It gives me a little bit of confirmation that all hope is not completely lost here in Michigan. Um, there's still a little bit of money to be made. So we're going to see how much... It, how We're going to see exactly how much I can make today. I'm not going to expect too much. I really wanted to reach like $200, but that's looking like not possible. But let me go in here and put my clothes in the washing machine and I will catch you guys a little bit later. It is officially a wrap right now. Um, the time is now 4.29 p.m. I just did my last delivery for today. It was finally a DoorDash order. It was coming from Chipotle. It paid like $6.25 to go about 3.2 miles. And the only reason I took that order is because not only did I get tired of declining orders, but it put me a little bit over making $50 today. Nonetheless, I'm going to end this video and I just want to throw out there that I am surprised that I was able to make what I made. I did not think that it was possible anymore, but granted, it did take me quite some time. I've been outside since 11.10 this morning. So that is 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, about, about 4 hours and 10 minutes, so... 
let's just say I've been out or is that five? <laughs> 12, 1, 2, 3, 4. I'm sorry. I'm a little sleepy, but five hours and 10 minutes I've been outside. Now, I can't say consistently because it took me about 45 minutes to do laundry. So, as far as consistently declining and delivering orders, we're going to say three hours and maybe 30 minutes. So, within about three and a half hours of my time, I made $50 or $51 and some change. Not terrible. It's not terrible, but it used to be better. That's all I can say. I checked the other platforms like Instacart and Shipped. Wasn't worth my time like I mentioned previously. Um, but I made some money. I guess that's all that matters. So I will be trying again tomorrow. Um, I might try later on in the day. I don't really know because there's too much that goes on outside, especially when it gets dark. So I'd rather not, but I might try later on in the evening tomorrow. We will see. But I do have to do gig work throughout the week or it has to be on a weekday. I can't do it on the weekend because I actually at my full-time job. So, um yeah so in the middle of the week it does suck for more reasons than one because it's not the weekend where people are maybe a little inebriated and they want something to eat okay i don't really know but today was just okay it feels good to actually make some money extra money i've been missing it but um yeah i only did what four or five orders i think it was five I don't think I did more than five orders. So it was okay. I don't know if I'll be doing a video tomorrow. I just might because I know y'all probably want one. And Thursday, I'm thinking about accepting every DoorDash order. I'm really thinking about doing it again just to see if there's any hidden tips. Because a lot of the offers I got were like very little to go very far. And y'all know I don't play that. But I'm curious to see if there are any hidden tips behind some of these dollar amounts that are being thrown my way. But I have officially reached a 0% acceptance rate. But after that one order I completed, I'm back at 1% with DoorDash. But um, that's it because now I feel like I'm rambling. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and for the support. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, I will see you in the next video. All right, you guys. I couldn't help myself. I had to do this one last order at Chipotle, paying $8.24, going like 2.4 miles. So this is the last order, and it's going to put me at like $59 and some change, or exactly at $60 and like maybe five cents. So I'm on my way to drop it off. And this is the end of the video, for real, for real. All right, bye.